Hello and welcome. My name is Vicky Marie and I'm going to be taking you through a very short yoga practice. You could do this practice in the morning or if you need a break in the afternoon, a bit of an energy boost, any time that may suit you. No props are required, no mat, just yourself in about five minutes. So when you're ready, we're going to begin to come into a standing position, having the feet about hip width apart, maybe closer if you want a bit more intensity. Meaning to roll the shoulders back, palms in line with the thighs or facing forward. Maybe softening or closing the eyes. And just taking a few rounds of breath here, feeling the shoulder blades ripple down the rib cage. We'll begin to take the arms up overhead. So we're gonna take this left hand, it's gonna grab your right fingertips or your wrist. We're gonna bend the knees, we're gonna go over towards the left. And we might stay here, maybe we lift up that right heel. Maybe we begin to take a gentle curtsy. When we're ready, we'll begin to take the arms back up towards the sky and we're gonna hinge down. Fingertips coming down towards that left foot and then sending the hands towards the back of the space. Flat back, long neck. Inhaling, taking the arms up overhead. This right foot will begin to meet the left. We're gonna take a cactus. Arms are going back up. And we'll take this on the other side. Right hand grabbing the left fingertips of the wrist, softening the knees, going over to the side. Again, we can stay here, maybe lifting the left heel, maybe taking that left leg behind. I'm beginning to take the arms up and we're gonna soften and fold, letting the hands and the head go heavy. Staying here, beginning to send the fingertips towards the back of your space. Arms beginning to go up. Left foot coming to meet the right. We're going to cactus, softening the knees, cactusing the arms. And we'll begin to take the arms up overhead. And we're going to begin to come into a forward fold, softening and folding. I'm going to change my angle slightly. And within this forward fold, we're going to take a ragdoll. Hands to opposite wrists or elbows, letting the head go heavy. You might sway the torso side to side. And then beginning to come back to stillness. Releasing the hands down. We're going to take a variation of a halfway lift. So beginning to take hands to thighs, shins, or maybe peace fingers to the earth. And you might stay right here. This could be your happy place. Otherwise, you're going to begin to lift the heels, coming onto the balls of the feet. Softening the jaw. Beginning to release the heels, coming back to your forward fold. We'll take that one more time, halfway lift. Your choice of hands, staying here, beginning to roll forward, lifting the heels. Again, releasing the heels, folding down. We're going to begin to come back up to standing, taking the arms up overhead. And we'll begin to cactus, softening the knees, cactusing the arms. Hands are going up. We're going to take that curtsy one more round. Left hand grabbing the right fingertips or wrists, softening the knees, going over towards the left. Staying here, lifting the heel or stepping behind. We'll begin to take the arms up and we're going to begin to hinge and fold. Taking the hands behind. And if you want to take it further, beginning to come up onto the ball of that left foot, lifting the heel will be a smidge of a movement. Releasing the heel down, taking the arms back up overhead and right foot coming to meet the left, cactusing the arms. Arms going up, Right hand grabbing the left fingertips of the wrist, softening the knees, going over to the right. 
Making your choice with that left foot for taking our curtsy. I'm beginning to take the arms overhead. We're hinging and folding, staying here, or setting the hands to the back. Now we can stay grounded or beginning to come up onto the ball of that right foot, lifting the heel, wobbling's expected. Releasing the heel, taking the arms back up overhead. And left foot coming to meet the right. We'll finish with a cactus, softening the knees. And begin to take the arms up overhead and taking the hands down into the heart space. And gently beginning to bow the head to the hands in gratitude for investing in your well-being and your practice. Thank you for taking this very short quick standing flow with me. If you liked this practice and would like to take a longer flow, check out the playlist in the description, hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon.